Welcome ladies and gentlemen to episode 8 of Universe Mode. Tonight we have got three Money in the Bank qualifying matches. Because Money in the Bank is coming up in a couple of weeks time. Actually next Sunday um, in this timeline. See here. And we've got three matches aside. Raw's three men that will go ahead to the Money in the Bank ladder match. And those matches I will show you right now is Dolph Ziggler versus Sheamus, Braun Strowman versus Elias, and Ricochet versus Keith Lee. And we also have a stacked main event: Drew McIntyre versus Randy Orton. Okay, it's this episode of Monday Night Raw. Here we go. Monday Night Raw, the two weeks away from money in the bank. Sapped car tonight. Let's get right into the first money in the bank qualifying match. So, the first qualifying match we have got up. Dolph Ziggler, the first competitor Dolph Ziggler has been underrated during his time in WWE only well, won one major world title that was the World Heavyweight Championship but now that that title is back and the Universal title is gone could we see Dolph Ziggler reclaim what he thinks is rightfully his Let's get out of shape, us, ladies and gentlemen. There he is, the Celtic warrior. In all new attire. I tried to recreate his actual attire from in real life. I, I think I did a decent job. Obviously, Sheamus is also a former world champion and wants to be back up in the main event. Can the Celtic Warrior overcome? The girl stealer or will Dolph Ziggler fall to the utter strength of Sheamus? Let's find out in tonight's matchup, which is live. Dolph Ziggler, Sheamus, we're underway. A kick by Ziggler and a DDT ready to Sheamus. See, Sheamus is back in his old attire, trying to forget about the bar days here. And being the world champion will help him greatly. Oh, oh, shoulder barge by Sheamus. Oh, dot, kick to the knee. Sheamus throws him. Oh, kick to the abdomen. And a drop kick which is missed. Punch by Sheamus. Throws him into the corner. Oh, head first into the corner. Dolph. From Sheamus to the apron. And Ziggler. Oh my. A neck breaker from the ring. Apron. Oh Ziggler got him in a wrestling hold. If you know Ziggler used to do wrestling in high school. Picks up Sheamus but Sheamus throws Ziggler over his shoulder and a kick to the back of Dolph. Sheamus picks up Ziggler, Ziggler throws him 
and oh punch the Sheamus he's going back up and throws him out the ring oh Sheamus catches Dolph with an STO and gets quickly back into the ring awaiting Dolph Oh, oh, rings his head against the rope there. Picks up Sheamus and snake eyes against the rope. Oh, Ziggler going top rope here. What's he going to do? Sheamus is dealing to his feet. Oh, that drop kick. That went very weird. Ziggler, oh, a kick to Sheamus' knee. He picks up Sheamus. Oh, famous by Ziggler. And, is he going to get it? The zigzag by Dolph. Cover. One, two. Sheamus kicks out at two. The Celtic Warrior isn't going down without a fight or... More like, oh. What's going on here? Oh my god! Bobby Roode! The glorious DDT by Bobby Roode! Bobby Roode from SmackDown making a statement! Bobby Roode on Smackdown but just interfered on Raw oh Ziggler with a drop kick to Sheamus also we know Ziggler and Bobby Roode are real life partners what tag team partners but now Dolph's on Raw he's in a similar position to Sheamus but Roode just reminded him of what is going on Sheamus picks up Ziggler and oh Ziggler with a push to Sheamus oh reversed by Sheamus Ziggler with a kick to the stomach picks up Sheamus puts it on the rope and a clothesline out of the ring oh Ziggler has Sheamus up throws Sheamus back in the ring What's he going to do here? Famous are again to Sheamus. Turns Sheamus over. Oh, stomps to the face of Sheamus. Sheamus. Trying to go for a maneuver there, but Ziggler reverses. Punches him in the back. Oh, Sheamus is bleeding as Ziggler goes for DDT. Oh, Ziggler in the corner. Going for not switching music, but a super kick to Sheamus. Cover again. One, two, three. That is it. Ziggler, after an emphatic performance and look not being on his side, especially as Bobby Roode. Gives him the glorious DDT there. It looked like Sheamus had it in the bag there. Both like Ziggler used perseverance and won. Another famous sir. But Ziggler with a sub kick wins the matchup. Let's move on to the let's move on to the next matchup that we have tonight. Alistair oh, Black in the ring now. What's he doing? here tonight I thought he had the night off WWE Universe I'm out here tonight because you deserve better you deserve superstars who will fight for you not for themselves you deserve superstars who have honour decency and respect for this business you deserve the best but you're not going to get it so I'm here to chase that right now this guy makes jokes he makes threats he makes me sick 
I'm not gonna stand I'm not going to stand it a second longer. Nothing changes until someone takes action, and that someone is me. What do you say, WWE Universe? Do you want to see me Ricochet do this or what? Well, then let's go. Black calling out Ricochet, will he respond? That's his music, alright, but is that Ricochet? That is Ricochet. He has come out to confront Alistair Black. Silence, you people need to understand that there is a time and place to be raucous. But this is not that moment. I have come out here to address a concern I have with this gentleman in the ring. So I appreciate if you all sat in your seats and remained quiet so I can give this man the verbal tongue lashing he deserves. Oh yeah, you ready to dance or what, big boy? And I don't mean fight, I mean literally let's dance. I'm feeling freaky tonight. I think you need a reality check because there isn't anything you can say that will change the fact that I'm one of the best damn superstars in this company has ever seen. I don't need to convince these people of how great I am because I prove it when the bell rings. The reason why you talk so much is because you can't back up anything you say. Strong words here by these two men. Did it feel good to finally get all, all of that off your chest? All of you wait to say that to me. How many times you practiced that little speech in the mirror? Well, congratulations, you got my attention. Now I want to see if you've trained your ring skills as much as you rehearsed that speech. I don't know whether to attribute the words coming out of your mouth to courage or stupidity. I way it makes no difference, I'm publicly requesting that the authority grant me my wish and give me the opportunity to stuff each one of those words back down your throat. Big words little man, you're spoiling for a fight, you know it's going to happen tonight, but mark my words, we're going to fight at a time and place of my choosing, and when we do, they're going to be carrying you out on a stretcher. You guys are so great. We should pie. I brought you all a nice cake, except I ate it. But it's okay, because I got everyone punch. Except I drank it because I was first to eat the cake. But that's okay, because I brought kazoos. Except I left them at home. What? You are just one disappointment after another. A series of disappointments. You can't plan a party. You can't wrestle, just go home. Go back home and throw yourself a pipe for how utterly useless you are. You get it. I get it, you're nervous. We're in this bombastic city, you don't want to look like an ass. Here's the thing though, you always look like an ass. So you can duck and dodge all you want, but the WWE Universe and I will always remind you of what you are when you're in this ring. So, bye bye, ass. Ricochet runs off. Brilliant confrontation. But we know Alistair Black has an open challenge tonight. Not for the IC title, but just in general. Before his match against Kevin Owens. We know that Ricochet wants a shot, but he has to get in line. Let's see that match right now. Here we go. Arthur Black's match is up next. And what we have just received a tweet from CM Punk himself that says, Ladies and gentlemen, whilst I may not be at the arena tonight, I am definitely watching at home. And after the feisty words I heard from Ricochet, I think this calls for a triple threat match. Alistair Black. Kevin Owens, Ricochet. All three men will battle it out for the Intercontinental Championship. Next Sunday at Money in the Bank. I don't think that's just it. If Alter Black wins tonight's match against his opponent, 
he will get to choose the stipulation. And if Ricochet wins his match against Keith Lee, he picks the stipulation. But if both of them lose, then Kevin Owens decides. Woo! Big announcement tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Ricochet has been added to the IC title match at Money in the Bank, but the stipulation is unknown. It's up to these three men to decide. Black needs to win and make sure Ricochet loses. Ricochet needs to do the opposite. And Kevin needs to make sure they both lose tonight. But what an announcement by CM Punk. Now we have Black out here. Let's see his opponent. Oh boy, this is going to be a matchup. Someone Alistair Black is all too familiar with. The phenomenal one, AJ Styles. AJ, probably one of the best performers in our generation. And he's going up tonight against one of the most underrated performers in our generation, Alistair Black. This is going to be a fight, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to be a spectacular fight. But who will come out on top between these two men? Black needs this win now. He could have just lost this and been fair and square with it, but he needs this win against the phenomenal one, the face that runs the place. AJ looking confident as ever. But who will come out on top? Let's, let's find out. Black Styles. And we are underway. I am playing AJ Styles for this one. Oh, Styles with a reverse on a drop kick to Black. Oh, throws Black against the corner. And, oh, misses Black. With a wrestling hold to Styles. This is brutal performance tonight. Styles throws Black off him. And Black with a, oh, a a stump to the arm oh, Styles and a stump to the stomach. Oh, Styles has hold of his leg and swirls it around. Oh, kick to Black. Oh, Styles. A knee to the face of Ballister. I have to take his glasses off, honestly. First Black against the ring apron. And what's he doing here? Oh, on the outside. No. A back body drop to the apron. Oh, black reverses. So Styles on a drop kick. AJ getting back in the ring. AJ waiting in the corner for black. Oh, black throwing Styles into the corner. Oh, he misses. And a drop kick again by Styles. Oh, Styles. Oh, he's trying to pick up Black, but Black reverses. Oh, a kick by Black. Black throws Styles off the rope. And a German suplex by Black, but Styles gets straight back up. Oh, he throws Black, but Styles. Oh! Sidewalk slam on the knee. Black in the corner. Oh, he reverses. Oh, the knee misses. And Styles throws him off and a close line. Oh, what's he gonna do here? Another knee to the face of Alistair Black. He picks up Black here. Throw Black to the corner. Gets Black up. 
Oh, black reverses. And a kick. Oh, a knee reversed. That's black up again. Black reverses again. Oh, connects. Oh, I think Black was trying to go for his finisher there. But Styles found his way out of it, and Black with a stomp to the stomach of Styles. And now Black in the corner, waiting for Styles to get up. Oh, a reversal by Styles into a. Is it a Styles clash? The cover. One, two, three. Styles beats Black. It looks like Alistair will not be picking the stipulation, but a brilliant reversal by Styles gives him the win. Oh, Styles going after Alistair here. Oh wait. It's Kevin Owens. I don't think we're expecting Kevin Owens tonight. But obviously we know Kevin wants to be the only person that gets a ha his hands on Alistair Black. Throw Kevin into the corner. Oh, Kevin reverses. Oh, what's this? Styles. Drop toe hold. Throws Kevin into the corner again. Picks Kevin up. Oh, what's he doing here? Styles. No. A superplex to Kevin Owens. Egging Owens to get up. Dolls goes to the outside. And a phenomenal four out to Owens. Making the statement that no one runs up on the phenomenal one. But is this going to be it for these men? Well, ladies and gentlemen, we have uh, another Money in the Bank qualifier match between Elias and Braun Strowman. Let's get into it. Here we go. The monster among men making his charge to the ring. Where is it? There he is. If this man makes his way to the Money in the Bank match, then no one will survive. Elias is everyone's only hope at this point to stop this 385 pound behemoth. Let's bring him out here. Elias. There he is. We know WWE stands for Walking Elias, but what money the bank stand for Elias's playground? If he beats Strowman tonight, and if he does, this could be one of the biggest steps forward for Elias in his career. But ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, let's get into this bloodbath. Braun Strowman, Elias. Oh, Elias starts strong with a knee. Oh, Strowman gets back. Oh, and another knee rocks Strowman. Looks like Elias has found a technique with the knees. Oh, gets him in the corner. Strowman, professor, we have 
kicked in the knee, not the knee, the stomach. Oh. Throws Elias, but Elias reverses, turns him around. And a shoulder barge by Elias, throwing him off the floor. Oh, and a DDT. Picks up Strowman, and Elias, oh, a knee to the face again. Rock Strowman, and Strowman's out the ring. Pulls Strowman back into the ring. Kicks Elias in the face. Oh! Now this is the Strowman we all came to see tonight. Just ragdolling. Elias across the ring. And a cover by Strowman. One. Kick out by Elias. I've got to say, Elias is doing a lot better than I expected here tonight. Oh, wait. Elbow to the stomach. And, oh, Lufez pressed by Elias. Elias going up to the top rope. And an elbow drop to Strowman. Pick Strowman up. Strowman, oh, with an uppercut. And Strowman picks up Elias. Oh, Slammed him back to the mat. And going for a cover here. One. Two. Elias kicks out at two. Strowman. Is he setting up for the running power slam? Looks like he is. Oh, Elias reverses with an inverted DDT. Elias. Going for the pin on Strowman. One. Kick out at one by Braun. Oh. Strowman just throwing Elias across the ring. Oh, Elias with an elbow to the face. Throws Strowman into the corner. Elias with an elbow to Strowman. Not an elbow, a knee. And he's dragging Strowman in the corner here. Strowman's back up and picks up Elias. Oh, drops him on the knee of Strowman. Picks up Elias. Elias. Oh, that's got to distract Strowman and a DDT. Cover. Kick out for a count of one. Elias setting up for Castaway here. Oh, and he, he got it on Strowman. Is this it for Braun? Will Elias go through to Money in the Bank? Oh, Strowman kicks out before the count of one again. This doesn't look like it's affecting Strowman at all. Right to the eyes of Strowman. Oh, Strowman picks up Elias for a Standing suplex. So just standing there examining his prey. Which is fighting back aggressively. Dropping him on the mat in a power bomb. Elias just on his knees. Looks like he's praying. Gets back up. Strowman. Oh! Elias with a kick to the knee and brings down Strowman. What's Elias doing here? Going up to the top rope again for what seems to be an elbow drop which is missed by Elias. Strowman forcefully picking up Elias for oh, a clothesline and drops him over, throws him over him and a spine buster. He picks up Elias now. Oh, he's going for the power bomb again. Drops it. 
on the mutt on his face again. But this is it for Elias. One, two, kick up by Elias. Strowman waiting for Elias to get up and he finally got it. The running power slam by Strowman and a cover. Rope break. Picks up Elias now. At military press. Oh, reversed by Elias into a DDT. Elias going back up to the top rope. This is it. The elbow drop. And in the corner, Elias was he's removing the turnbuckle. Strowman for Castaway. Two. Three. Oh, the ref's fixing the turnbuckle. A low blow by Elias, the ref didn't see it. Elias dragging Strowman to the centre of the ring. The ref was just busy doing the turnbuckle and a blow blow to. Oh! Strowman kicked out at two. But a low blow by Elias nearly ended it. The ref was sorting out the turnbuckle of a, that Elias removed. And. Punch to the face. Elias taunting now. Picks up Strowman. Out. Oh, flurry of punches and chops. Goes over for a STO. Oh. Going after the knee of Strowman. Trying to Strowman. Near the rope. Oh, Elias. Got his feet against the ropes. And Strowman kicks out. Throws Elias into the turnbuckle. Strowman. Oh. Elias reverses with a judo throw. And chopping and punches his weight. Strowman with a kick. Picks up Elias. Oh, power slam to the turnbuckle. And a power slam by Strowman. That's got to be it. One. Two. Elias kicks out the counter. Two. Strowman picks up Elias. Oh, Elias reverses with kicks to the knees of Strowman. Oh, he got Strowman again for Castaway. One, two. Strowman kicks out to counter two. Elias has pulled out everything in his arsenal, but Strowman's still going. Lufez plays again by Elias. Knee to the chest of Strowman. Picks up Braun. And he's going to throw him into the corner. Oh, close line to Strowman. And then Elias. A bulldog. To the second rope now. Strowman's bleeding and an elbow dropped to Strowman. Elias looking down at the piece of work he'd made. Wait for Strowman to get off here. Oh! Has he got it again? Cast away! One, two, three! Elias has beaten Strowman! So the second member for Raw to go to the Money in the Bank is Elias. Oh, Elias get out of the ring, but what's he doing? Oh, he's beating down on Strowman again with kicks. Stomping him. Stomping a mud hole in him. 
Strowman is not the same. But we have one more qualifier match. Keith Lee versus Ricochet. This is Ricochet's chance to pick the stipulation. Let's get right into it. Here we go. Ricochet, the king of high flying. If Ricochet wins, he's in two matches at at um, Money in the Bank. One for the IC title and one for the world title. Well, one for the Money in the Bank for the world title. Or the WWE title. But this will not be an easy task for Ricochet. As his opponent is the limitless one, Keith Lee. And there he is. The limitless Keith Lee. Next T people used to bask in his glory. But on the main roster he hasn't done much. His biggest win was against Randy Orton. That payback, but that's pretty much it ever since then his career's gone on a downhill spiral. But he had a chance to chase that. And if he wins, then he will be added to the money in the bank ladder match. Obviously we know that on the SmackDown side so far Cesaro is one of the competitors in the Money in the Bank for SmackDown. Here we go. The matchup is live now. Ricochet, Keith Lee. Let's go. Oh. Knee to the stuck. <sighs> oh, Keith Lee already getting Ricochet ready and up for the attitude adjustment. Cover one, two, three. Keith Lee just beat Ricochet in 13 seconds. And Ricochet is respecting him for it. You know what this means? Kevin Owens is picking the stipulation. And Keith Lee is the last Raw competitor for... I just can't believe that Keith Lee won in 13 seconds. But this isn't it, ladies and gentlemen. We have the main event. Randy Orton versus Drew McIntyre. Here we go. Oh, not again, these two. Roman Reigns and Paul Heyman out here for what? Ladies and gentlemen, my name is, you know the spiel, tonight is the night for spiel. So why don't we get right to the point of how deep we upset my client is right now. I'd like to utilize this precious time to talk about WWE Superstar who's not my client. This superstar is brash, rude, untalented, pathetic, spoon fed, everything your mother taught you not to be. Ladies and gentlemen, I think we all who know, we all know who I'm referring to, right? So without further ado, Drew McIntyre, I am pleading with you, come out here right now. Satisfy my client's appetite, face him like the man that you are not. 
Show this world why my client is the most dangerous piece of art that no one should ever piss off. Oh, here he comes. The Scottish psychopath. Roman's opponent at money in the bank. Roman, what, Ray's just, like, looking at him like, are you serious? Obviously not McIntyre's in the main event, you know, against Randy Orton. So what does the two have to say? Uh, the respect for the WWE Universe, I'd come out here and say something. You see, I'm, I love you, those chat, Paul. I know you love to see things through your tiny little scope, but everything you say is absolutely horse crap. Looks like Roman's not in a mood to talk tonight. He just walks up to McIntyre. Oh, what a punch to the face of McIntyre! Roman not in the mood tonight. Oh, what's Roman doing here? Oh, McIntyre reverses with a kick to the stomach. McIntyre with a shoulder charge to Reigns. And a... Uh, oh, a stomp to the arm of Roman. McIntyre with a ground and pound on the tribal chief. Oh, what's McIntyre doing here? Picks up Reigns and just... Uh, Power bomb! Oh, Reigns is out of there quick. And throws McIntyre into the barricade. Oh, Reigns reverses and a uh, oh, old wrestling takedown. McIntyre against the apron. No, Reigns reverses and an elbow and against the apron and into the barricade. Reigns will have to get out of here because it's McIntyre versus Orton next. Okay. After 10 minutes of Drew getting a bit of medical attention to his back, he's back and ready to go. Looks like Reigns blasted him into the barricade a couple of times, didn't really help him. Maybe that might be a point of concern for Money in the Bank. Because just like the IC title picture, if McIntyre loses tonight, Reigns picks the stipulation, but if McIntyre wins, he picks the stipulation. Also, we know Kevin Owens will be picking the stipulation for the triple threat. Um, I forgot the name, but the triple threat IC title match. But Drew is out here and he is pissed. Roman got the better hand against McIntyre. Or well, the upper hand, should I say. But McIntyre is ready to face one of his former opponents. Someone who put McIntyre to the limit during the summer of 2020. The Apex Predator, the Legend Killer, the Viper, the E Legend, Randy Orton. Let's get him out of here right now. Oh boy, the 14 time world champion, Randy Orton. from St. Louis, Missouri. In my opinion, has one of the most consistently great theme songs. Obviously, his old one was better, in my opinion. But, Randy, with the three most destructive letters in entertainment today. No, it's not HBO. It's not WWE. It's R. K. 
Oh. This match done it all, but in the bank, IC title, US title, world title, WWE title, tag titles, Royal Rumble winner. And tonight he goes up against one of the best in the business at the moment. The Scottish warlord, Drew McIntyre. Drew's been preparing for this match for the last two weeks. Let's see how it will pan out. As Orton takes poise to do the iconic. Let's get into it. Drew McIntyre, Randy Orton. It's go time. I am playing McIntyre here because I just want to. Bro, bro, that's by McIntyre. And into the corner, Randy Orton goes. McIntyre just stalking his prey. Oh, oh, bro! Kick to the stomach of Orton as he tried to reverse that. McIntyre with a roll up, and Orton gets out of it. Looks like McIntyre wants to avoid being in the ring for long with Randy Orton because we know. How deadly Randy Orton can be at picking apart his enemies. But also, we know McIntyre doesn't want to have any injuries before Money in the Bank because that could cost him massive. Oh, Orton reverses McIntyre! McIntyre can't get injured, otherwise, that'll cost him massively. But McIntyre just walks up the steps, punches Orton in the face. Oh, picks up Orton. Bear hug suplex across the ring. McIntyre just wait for Orton to get up here. And a boot by McIntyre. He picks up Randall. And oh, brutal forearm. Oh, McIntyre with a clothesline to Orton. And. Oh, a stomp to the face. McIntyre taking apart the knee of Orton. And again. Oh, and one more time for good measures. Oh, McIntyre with a standing throwing suplex to Randy Orton. Oh. Randy it with a leg sweep. Picks up McIntyre and Ooh. a neck breaker. One, two, rope break by McIntyre. McIntyre uses real awareness, which he's been known for to his advantage. Oh, Dol oh, Orton rings his hand up. Oh, and again. Oh, oh, and doing the same thing McIntyre did to him. Oh, what's McIntyre doing? Oh, he's got him up. For the Scottish curse. Pins Orton. One, two. Oh, oh, gets out. McIntyre. Backing it up. Oh, Orton's already up. McIntyre front Orton into the corner and McIntyre. Oh, a oh, brutal. Front Orton back into the same corner. What's doing here? Oh, he puts Orton up to the top rope. Oh, what's McIntyre doing? Has Orton up for a top rope back body drop. 
That has got to sting. Sonatized by my container. Oh, altered out to the apron. McIntyre doing the same thing. Oh, tried to grab Orton, but Orton just elbows him off the ring apron. Oh, Randy throwing McIntyre back into the ring. McIntyre reverses. Oh, and a clothesline to Orton. Throws Orton out the ring. McIntyre joins him here. Oh, Orton again. McIntyre gets up. Oh, both of them in the ring. McIntyre throwing Orton into the corner. Turns him round here. Oh, no. In the tree of woe. Ah! No, McIntyre, don't do it. Oh, knee to the stomach. Clifford picks up Orton and a Scottish headbutt is reversed by her elbow. RKO by Randy. One, two, three. Orton again wins. Looks like Roman will be picking the stipulation. At money in the bank Randy looking happy with himself there again beating his former adversary Drew McIntyre ladies and gentlemen that brings a close to tonight's episode of Monday Night Raw. Thank you all for watching this great show tonight. As it says there. Uh, I'll talk to you all later. For the Go Home Show of Monday Night Raw. Take care everyone. Thank you all for watching. And. Uh, I'm filming this on. Thursday evening. So. Um, the chase will happen in a couple of days but by the time this comes out the chase is already done um, but yeah get ready for money in the bank the go home show is next take care your boys out back to the shadows back to his realm and his domain take care and goodbye